I'm done with the general options and now I'm going to the registration page. And if you first see the page, if you're gonna use the preview page button, it's very simple. You will see um, the the title and um, time zone, and it's just very plain and simple. And it's not what you want for your own webinar because you can style everything in your own branding. So let's use the branding of WP Webinar System, and that's the green color with gray or white. So um, I want a white background color. I'm gonna use an image for the content. Going to upload it. And I want the title to be in the green color and this one in the gray color. So I'm going to save it so you can see what I've done until now. So this is the preview page. I'm going to refresh the page. And you will see that um, the title is adjusted to the new color. And I have my own picture here. So let's do the right thing, the, the box here, the opt-in box. And of course it will be nice to have it in the same colors and branding as we usually have. So we have um, configured the general tab on this uh, registration page tab. Now we're going to configure the form. So I'm going to be I'm going to do it a little bit faster than I did before. Um, white join us during this live webinar uh, the button which is here you can also give it your own uh, styling. I'm going to make it a little bit more stand out so people will see it. Actually, on the green background, I'm going to use no border. So I'm going to use the same color. White text. And the call to action on the button is uh, yes. Um, uh, yes, join for free. Login. This is the, the other tab, the login tab, also with a button. Um. So I'm going to use the same colors for the button. And last but not least, the description box. It's this one uh, on the bottom of the page. And I'm going to make it also um, green. So let's see how that looks like. So this is my registration page until now. You can always adjust it if you want something uh, to be different, but that's it for now.